Hello folks, hope and pray you are doing great. Welcome to Guru Tech Solutions. In today's video we will acquaint our viewers with the ultimate solution for accelerating academic reading and writing. Let me introduce a cutting-edge AI tool that could revolutionize the way you read and write scholarly content, boosting your productivity to new heights. Say goodbye to time-consuming research and endless drafts. Unriddle AI leverages advanced natural language that would facilitate in quickly finding information in documents, simplify complex topics, take notes, and also helps to write with the power of AI. Whether you're a student racing against deadlines or a researcher aiming for efficiency, Unriddle AI is your indispensable companion. Without further delay, let's dive into First of all, open your web browser and in search bar type on Riddle. Then various links will be provided. But you need to click the very first link to access the Unriddle AI tool. By clicking, you will land on the official page of this AI tool. Here, you can see it has been explicitly highlighted that this AI tool can help you find information in documents quickly and it simplify complex topics. Besides, this can help you take notes and write using the power of AI. I am scrolling down you can see the official page of this AI tool. It has been trusted by thousands of researchers and students around the globe. To begin with, you just need to click get started. Then you will land here. At the right top click sign in and from here, you will choose to continue with Google. Then you just need to select your Gmail account in order to log in. Let me input my password. Once you are done with the process this interface will appear before you. It will ask you to choose one of these as per your role. Since I am using it for personal use so I will choose it. Then finally, this interface will appear. From here, you can upload your downloaded PDF files to interact with or you can paste your entire text to have specific knowledge about it. Let's upload our academic paper which I have already downloaded. Let me select it from my folder. Once selected it will be uploaded and it might take few seconds depending upon your connectivity. Once the paper is uploaded, you can see the article on the left side of your screen. Here's the article and on the right side, you can see a blank space where you can input your questions pertaining to the research. So, let's suppose, I want to ask, what this article is all about. Once done with typing then hit enter. Then this AI will process, and it will bring forth the result pertaining to our concern. Here, you can see it is bringing the results. Prior to this I didn't have knowledge about this paper, now I can see this research article is about examining the impact of information technology, specifically in mathematics classroom. It means this article is all about technology integration in mathematics classroom. At the end of each section, you will see page numbers from where this particular information has been taken. Now, this time I want to ask about which particular methodology has been used while carrying out this very study. Once you are done with the typing, then you will hit enter and this AI tool will process, and it will bring forth the results pertaining to the particular methodology that has been adopted while carrying out this study. Here, you can see, this research study uses a multi-level regression model and multi-level model to enlarge the impact of information communication and technology integration in classroom. Similarly, other text has also been provided and by the end of text, you can see page numbers from where this particular information has been extracted. Last but not least, this time I'm interested to find out few of the major takeaways from this paper. So, I will type my question in the given space and then hit enter. As discussed above this will process and it will bring forth the result. You can see, it has highlighted particular takeaways from this study. So, it says this research found that school-level factors play a significant role in integration of ICT into teaching and learning. So, this AI tool has highlighted few of the takes away from this particular research and by the end of this section, you can see page numbers from where these key points have been taken. So, in this way you can ask questions about particular uploaded PDF files. Now, I have uploaded a few more documents you can see. 
this one and this one. This means you can upload number of PDF files at a time. Here, you can see after uploading a particular file this AI tool analyzes that PDF document and generates various questions pertaining to that file. Here are few examples of the questions that have been generated by this AI tool. So, you can start by probing these predefined questions pertaining to the uploaded academic papers. So, here in this library we have uploaded the research articles related to ICT integration in mathematics classroom. You can see these are the articles. Now, we want to write some academic text. Therefore, we have to click here and choose notes. Then this interface will appear before us. Here at the top, we need to write the title of our write-up. As I am writing around technology integration. In the next line, we will begin our writing. Here I am typing technology integration plays important role in teaching and learning. This one-liner is enough to generate text using this AI tool. Now, I want this AI to generate text for me. So, I will select the entire text, and by selecting, I will get two options. The first one is about site, this particular selected text. The second option we have is about Ask AI. By clicking Ask AI, we will get various options. Here we can use this AI tool to improve writing, expand concepts, summarizing text. Besides, this AI tool can paraphrase the text and it also explains the text. So, this time I want this AI tool to expand the selected text which I have just written and selected. A paragraph with the help of single line will be written by this AI tool. Once this AI is done with writing you will have various options. We can insert this text above or we can replace this text by above text or even we can give it more tries to generate different and better text. So, I'm inserting the AI written text this time. Now, if you want to cite the written text with a particular study from your library, you just need to click the text and you have to click cite. Then this AI will find similar source from the library. Here you can see this particular text has been mentioned in the following article in our library which we have uploaded a while ago. By clicking the first article, it will automatically cite it in the written text in our single click. Similarly, if you want to add more citations you just need to select the text and an automatic citation will be added. In order to open the particular sources, you just need to click the source and the entire article will be opened. Let me go back to the write-up again. This time let's explore the other features. If you want to improve your writing using this AI tool, you just need to select the text. Then you can click Improve Writing. Then this AI will automatically generate text, which will be better and improved version of the selected text. Besides, you can use this tool to paraphrase the provided text and improve your academic writing. Now, let's discuss its pricing. So, to upgrade you will click Upgrade. And then we have this interface, you can see with its free version, you can write 10 notes and upload files per month. You can upgrade it to the Pro version and Premium version, the charges have been mentioned here. I found on Riddle AI an amazing tool to boost my academic work. This tool particularly helps in find information and documents quickly, simplify complex topics. Moreover, it facilitates to take notes and write with the power of AI. All these ultimately improves academic performance whether you are reading any academic paper or writing any assignment or thesis. We found it an amazing tool, please let us know your experience by comment on the video. Besides, if you liked in content and want to stay up to date for more such content, please don't forget to hit the subscription button. We will meet in next video, till that bye.